Hello and welcome to the tutorial on addition of three digit and two digit numbers. Addition of three digit and two digit numbers and we're going to do this with carrying. So let's start with our first example. What is 172 plus 19? 172 plus 19. Now we're going to do this using the vertical format. So the first stage is to rewrite the question in columns. So let's do that over here. 172 plus 19. And there we have it. And let's label the columns as well. So on the right hand side we have the units. The middle one is the tens column and the first one over here on the left is the hundreds column. Now you know the routine by now. What we do is we're going to add the columns one by one and we're going to start with the column on the right hand side first. So that is this one over here. 2 plus 9. Well 2 plus 9 is the same as 9 plus 2. We can just change the numbers around. 9 plus 2 is that's right, it's 11. How do we write that down in the vertical format? Well, you know this by now. We're going to put 1 here and 1 here. We've added the units. We're now going to add the tens column. The tens is this one over here, 7 plus 1. And don't forget the 1 over here. So what we have is 7 plus 1 plus 1. Well, 7 plus 1 is 8, so 8 plus 1 is 9. We're now going to add the hundreds and the hundreds column. Well, there's only, there's only the 1 over there. There's nothing over here. So that is simply just 1. And we have our answer. 191. So 1... 100... And 72 plus 19 is 191. That is correct. So adding the numbers using the vertical format is very easy. Now let's move to our second example. Let's just scroll down so we have a bit more space here. What is 564 plus 78. Now the numbers are larger here, but again, if we're using the vertical format, it's very straightforward, and the same principles always apply. So let's start by rewriting the question in the vertical format. 564 plus 78. We can label the columns, units, tens and hundreds. So let's begin as we always do by adding the column on the right hand side first. What is 4 plus 8? 4 plus 8. That's the same as 8 plus 4. The answer is 12. How do we write that down? We put 1 here and we put 2 over here. Now we add the tens column. That's the 6 and the 7. And don't forget the 1 over here. 6 plus 7 plus the 1. Well, 6 plus 7 is what? 13. Plus the 1 is... 14. How do we write that down? We put 
one in the next column and four over here. So we've added the units, we've added the tens, and now we're going to add the hundreds. Well, in the hundreds column, there is a five, there's nothing over there, and there is one over here. Five plus one is nice and easy, it's six. And that is our answer. Let's, let's read out the question and the answer. So 564 plus 78 is 642. That is correct. So as you can see, we'll scroll back up again. Whether the numbers are small or large, if you're using the vertical format, it becomes relatively simple if you stick to the principles. So that is the addition of a three-digit and a two-digit number with carrying.